shall bring victory. I will fight with honor. So, so some people don't understand why Nazoth is good with only three death rattles. It turns out that you don't actually need that many death rattles to make Nazoth good. If you cast Nazoth and you get just two of those three back, you're looking pretty good. And arguably, even if you just get one back, you're looking pretty good. Arguably. Do 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 pass. Are you mocking me? Oh, dragon or dragon priest. For justice. Looks like a lot of reactionary cards here. Uh, this may not be so good against Dragon Priest because most of their cards are low attack value already. My oh, not that one though. This would be an interesting card to play here. Five. You'd need the Holy Nova or Shadow Word Pain. Hmm. I'm gonna go with this play instead of that. Oh man, Kodo 50-50 here. I go for it. Get him! Eat him! Eat him! Yeah! Eaten. Hmm, that's a duck. That's a hand. Uh, go, guy. Get out there. Do I want to play a Doomsayer? It says turn seven. That'd be um, Chill Maw, but if he plays Chill Maw, I just Alder or Humility it. I feel like that deck is so slow that I can Doomsayer his play next turn. Are you mocking me? Yeah, I'll Doomsayer this. Face. Well, here comes the end. This is why I don't want to run to Forbidden Healing in the deck, incidentally. I'm just gonna get my big cards entombed. Probably. Maybe I just uh, try to make guys and win. By making guys. This is the place where. Uh, where just. This is the matchup where just the card True Heart will matter the most. I don't think playing this card is actually going to be good for me. You know, at this point, with so many cards in hand, uh, many of which are reactive based on the way he's been playing. It seems to me like there's going to be an Entomb in there. So playing any big card might be a mistake.
How many cards did you just draw of divine favor? As a priest. Three? Four. Impressive. Try to get value out of this card. Pretty late in the game, so pretty tough to get value out of it. Pretty good for me. Take a board clear. Hmm. Looks like it's uh It's sacred trial. I need this answer for something bigger. Hmm. But I'm also going to die a little too quickly if I don't do this. Just a little bit too quickly. Hmm. I've drawn almost none of my card draw so far. I've drawn zero of my card draw so far. There's not that much card draw on the deck, though. Yeah, I do need to save it against Ysera. Um, this is a problem. I guess this is the card that would be least bad to be gotten. Least bad to be nabbed. Because this card isn't one of the death rattle cards. You can play this card, and bait out the Entomb. Though you might have another Entomb. Yeah, this is pretty decent. Do I want to Kodo this guy? Now, Kodo is my hard removal for a big card. Hmm. Okay, he's almost fatiguing, so he doesn't really want the cards. I'm okay with this. Looks like my win condition is going to be fatigued here. Yeah, I need to save Kodo for either Ragnaros or Ysera, and then I need to use Equality for against either Ragnaros or Ysera. <laughs> I dream and the world Come on Quality No actually oh It's gonna be a fifty fifty. Oh man, fifty fifty time.
That's gross. Alright. Absolutely gross. Pretty good play. Chopped. Hmm. Yes, go ahead and draw a card. Ah, oh, you got that one. Gross. Why are you overcommitting? Okay, I play the Consecration, I hit that, I go down to 16, he has 7, 9, 10, 13. Consecration doesn't even kill anything. So I guess I play this card and I make a guy. What if he has Entomb? I guess he has Entomb. He has 7, 9, 12, 13, 16, which isn't lethal, and he shouldn't have any direct damage in his deck, I think. Unless that was right, no one damage. There's no burst in his deck. Don't feel good about that. Oh, looks like I win this game. Sick. Stalled long enough. Change your mind. Mm. Maybe I don't win. <laughs> Might win though. I have no time for games. <sighs> Maybe I don't win though. 4, 9, 12, 13. He doesn't have lethal. I have no more heals. Let me think. Hmm. I guess I should do this now. Okay. So I know his hand is a Ragnaros and three cards. One of the cards is probably death. Strange move. <laughs> Okay. That was a mistake. That might have been the worst possible move he could have done. <laughs> okay, I think his hand is a Azure Drake since he always runs two of those in the deck, and he's only played one. What a throw, right? What a throw. Oh dear. None may steal our secrets. For justice. A 
think I might have won regardless there. Possibly. I might have won regardless. Maybe. I think you're seven going face, programming, Mikey Kins, and general spoon. <clears throat> I didn't pilot it badly, I just drew badly. <laughs> Oh dear. This could be a problem. It's getting hot too soon. I have drawn you too soon. Doctor Seven, I mean Doctor Four. Well met. Doctor Four would actually be a really good uh, card for him to play for me right now. Thank goodness. That's exactly the card I wanted him to play. He's like, oh, ho, ho. He's... No, and I'm like, okay. Oh, tap. <laughs> Face? Silly. Not in my house. Soon there will be massive amounts of cheating. Hmm. Hopefully the cheating will be enough. Oh no, cheating might not be enough here. Do I want a forbidden healing for 12? No, I need to control the board more. Him lightning bolting that is a big deal since I can't sell him Vigil anymore. I can make it to turn 8 that Ragnaros will save me. Face! Face! Come on! No? Oh wow! Gross. You're despicable. Huh. The battle. So five and then two. So skip the healing, huh? They can't burst me for ten. They can burst me for ten. Oh, they, they can't burst me for twelve. All right. Well, they can technically, but it's pretty unlikely. For 
justice. Oh, ho, ho. only 10 damage. I'm afraid that's not enough. Do I want to heal for 16 or do I want to heal for 8? Oh no, it's not a guaranteed heal for 8 because this will be damaged. Or do I want to play Tyrion Fordring? I probably want to heal for 16. Cheat. The elements will destroy you. By the holy light! I can see what is to come. Don't worry, loves. The cavalry's here. Hmm, casually heal for another eight. Next turn I'll casually heal for 20. Yeah, got rid of his Urshock. What a shame. I guess I'll just taunt. <laughs> Never mind, I'll just heal for 20. <laughs> so awesome. Hmm. Oh, seven seven, still a problem. Fortunately, unfortunately, I can't get through this thing. Put your faith in the light. Here, let's do that. So uh, if I uh, Nazoth, only Tyrion will come back, but that's pretty good. It's getting hot in here. Tyrion Doomsayer, such a good play. Oh. Time for other Ragnaros. <laughs> what a game. What a game. Oh. So much cheating. Now keep Doomsayer in case he's Tempo Warrior. Yeah, I think I Doomsayer in response to Acolyte of Pain. Well, Doomsayer is just gonna suck the entire game.
Probably. This is a pretty good hand. I'm tempted not to play that card because of Fiery War Axe, but there's always the threat of Fiery War Axe. It's not like I can ever play this card and not fear the axe. Oh, wow, that's pretty good for me. Interesting. Since the Cthune deck, this uh, Just a Card True Heart will be amazing. Um. I think I just threw out this Tempo Elder. Because I need to spend a card. The I have an axe to grab. Oh, Kodo power. It's just like eating a turtle. Warrior can't beat, uh, what is this, the silver hand? Yeah. Maybe. You can't defeat the silver hand. I want to press the button. Uh, if I press the button, Sylvanas, I'm just going to brawl. I also have a full hand. I guess I play this card. I don't want to play that card in response to the card. Meh. Whoa. My hand is too full. Okay. <laughs> Always lucky though. Tempted not to play that because of a second brawl, but if you play a second brawl, then that's fine. The silver hand will get him eventually. 
And as a 50-50 of one of my Ragnaroses surviving. Smart Ragnaros. Die, insect. Hmm. I dodge brawls, boy. Boyo. Is someone injured? Hmm. Yes. Uh. From my experience of playing priest. It can be difficult for the priest to ever get any other plays. So, hit and heal is a reasonable one. Oh, I'll take that. Doomsayer is a good one. I think there's a decent chance this works, and if it doesn't work, it'll slow him down enough that Koda will get one of them. This interaction worked. That's pretty nice. One mana draw two. Ooh, just a card true heart. That is the best card. Um pow. Next turn just the card, and then I win the game. Alright, so I got my hard kill. Need to save it for something pretty big. Other than that, just pressing the button should be pretty good. Hmm. 
Hmm. Wow, that's really greedy. And yet, I don't really want to use any of my uh, cards because he can just Holy Nova it away. It seems like he's setting up for Holy Nova. I should just do this, transform this, hit that, and then make guys. I didn't punish him, but if I punished him, he would have punished me. So I dodged his punishment, I think. A 6-2 doesn't matter too much when I have 4 one ones It's perfect Holy Nova. This card's too annoying. I guess I just never deal with it. Could eat it. Eat half of it. I still have several hard kills. Hmm. What's my plays that don't involve eating it? I can just Aldor it, and that works too. Aldor, make guys. There's no real need to eat that thing. You never play this card because of, uh, Entomb. You need to bait it out with one of the Ragnaroses first. Or something else. Hmm. Then I'll do. Nice. Best target. By far. I have no time for games. I'm gonna kill the Sylvanas. Oh, he has Karen though. Oh, he also has this. I'm not gonna kill the Sylvanas. Huh. That's kind of interesting. Wait, I could have done... No, that would have been bad. Uh, no, I could have done equality into Consecration. I can still do that. Hmm. I wonder. I think it's still the right play. Dota's on point for that.
by the light. Sounds good enough to get entombed. Hmm. Shall I burn one equality consecration on this? Alright. Now we'll take a humility. And then do I Tyrion? No, I Cairn. Yeah. Your mind. For honor. It's actually okay uh, to play this Ragnaros. Doesn't matter if it heals this one or me. I'm kind of happy with either result. I might be happy if it heals Karen. Yeah, sure. It's big, but not big enough to use equality on. It seems... I don't know whether or not he's saving the Entomb for Tyrion. But I'm going to probably play Tyrion next turn. Hmm. I'm actually going to play Pyro next turn. With equality? No. No equality. Two, five. And then forbidden healing. Which means I'll be one off of killing that. Okay, more important to kill that, probably. Hmm. 
So I play the tier and hopefully he has no answer to it, and then I play Nazoth. That's the plan. But if he does have an answer to it, such as it gets entombed, I can still win by massing Silverhand Knights. Probably. Although perhaps I don't win. Maybe he only runs one entomb. It's possible. Kind of tough to fit two in a dragon deck. I haven't had a tough time fitting one. Excellent. Death. Great success. Which means he knows that the Nazoth will get him. Where's your light bomb, man? Sadness. For justice. The inevitability of the old gods. Where was I? Thank you, Mikey Kins, General, and Anna Banana for seven. Hmm. Okay, if it's patron, you save the qualities for the patrons. If it's control, I play just the card True Heart and then win the game. Also, I have an Azosto in the game. Seems hard for a control warrior to beat this deck. Patron warrior, all I have to do is have an answer to patrons. Tempo warrior. I think I can hold them off.
plan against Tempo or Pirate Warrior? Same plan against Face Shaman. What? No. You stave them off, and then you play Ragnarok Light Lord, and then you heal for 20. The Forbidden Healer. The Shield Block implies it's Control Warrior. Press button, win game. Probably good enough to eat. And all these people running Bloodhoof Brave makes Kodo even better. I'll eat that. I'd rather push the button than draw two cards or play a sword. Hmm. That drawing two is probably better than pushing the button because I can get just a card true heart, which is the card that I'm digging for. Or care. Oh, care. Alright. Yeah, I can see why Lay on Hands is cutting this deck now. It's a little too slow, since there's already so many big cards. Hmm. What now? Pain speak to me. Do I play the True Silver or do I play the Cairn? Actually, kind of close call. True silver hit this, make a guy. The guy threatens the tier one. But this is the slower play, and the slower play is probably better. There's no immediate need to rush down the uh, the acolyte there. I don't know if it's worth using a charge of the sword to kill it. I'm mostly doing it because of lack of hand size. Could also play Doomsayer. Nah.
Alright, at least time to burn in righteous fire. Alright. Almost? Now you face the stronger form of Ragnaros. Well, quote unquote stronger, actually. Let's go with that one. This one's better post Alex Strauss. Does Alex Strauss even exist? I don't know. It quite possibly doesn't. Kind of felt like swinging this, but I probably should have swung this because of Shield Slam. Oops. And also because of Tyrion. No. Um, eh. But I figured getting a 5 attack weapon is good enough. Plus the attack on him, I thought was. Oh my gosh. That's pretty good. Pretty good guy. Pretty good. Impressive. For justice. I should have thought about the play before making that play. This play, I mean. Hmm. Let's try this. I guess that's not too bad. That actually doesn't suck at all. It's fine. Now I'm seriously tempted not to make a guy here. Reason. Better against Brawl. If I make a guy, I think he brawls. But he's had so much armor that he can do shield slam anyways. I only reduced my odds of having Ragnar survive by, what is it, 17%? 17%? I have no time for games. Hmm, against this play, Ragnar's guy was a super better play. Interesting. Oh! That's actually not that good a play for him. Because he had to use uh, Sylvanas and a removal in order to take just an 8 8. I don't mind him having this card. Not gonna spend any quality on it. Let's see, how many cards do I wanna draw? 2, 5, 6. Let's draw a bunch of cards. I'll go down the seven, six, five cards in hand. I'll draw two. I'll go up to seven. Uh, he's used a revenge. Is that too greedy? Think about it. If I play just these, I'll go down to six cards. I'll go up to seven cards. Up to eight. It's gonna be... I can't afford to overdraw. Not to mention, Ragnaros will be at 1, which means he can cause me to overdraw pretty easily. 
Oh, he's already causing me to draw more cards. Okay. Hmm. Well, good thing I didn't play the Acolyte. This was the card I was drawing towards, though. This card, OP. Man, if I'd played both Acolytes, I would have gotten absolutely wrecked. Have all the health you want? My friend. You cannot beat the overwhelming armies of the Silver Hand. Acolyte of pain. Uh. Forcing him to draw an extra card is funny, but not that useful. Let's get him to draw two. Oh, I'm actually in range. Wait, how, how, how often have I been in range? Oh, because he hit me for six. Wait, was I in range last turn? Oh, this needs to happen. So I've had Cairn die and I've had uh, Tyrion die. It's pretty good for Nizoth. Sylvanas is also a good draw, of course. I wonder. Guy pass isn't bad. Pass. This card would have just gotten destroyed. These cards are being saved. one of them. Yeah, sure. His burst potential is 17, but the Gromish 12. So I have uh, one answer, and I have two answers, and I have three answer. I have three answer. I actually have, I still have a Keeper and two Alder Peacekeepers in the deck too, so I have a lot of answer.
Yeah, that's gonna be a Kodo answer. Hopefully it hits the guy, because otherwise I go into range. If I go into range, I think I just forbidden healing for four. Oh, that's good. Enough. Oh, no Alder. But I can do this. Uh, no need to rush out my cards, because I could also do two fives. No, I don't. Can't do He hasn't played any brawls yet, so I can't play Nazoth. He has the Golden Monkey, but he can't really play Golden Monkey, otherwise he loses. But he also can't not play the Golden Monkey, otherwise he loses. So basically I win. Pretty sweet. My great Kodo. I think playing Sylvanas for not playing Sylvanas, I win either way, but I'll just not play her. Two card golden monkey. Good luck with that. Oh, turns out this deck is pretty good. Huh. Do I play a worse deck or do I just keep playing this deck? <laughs> 